we do. There, they see you now. They see you now. Three, two, one. Six o'clock. <laughs> We're live. <laughs> it's alive. It's alive. Anybody there? Yoo hoo! Here we are. <laughs> Give people a minute to come in, huh? Give people a minute to come in. It doesn't now. It's six o'clock. You want me to put the butter around the pan? Not yet. Hi, Sally. Supposed to say hi. Hi, Sally. <laughs> Bye, Tom. Oh, I'm still here, right? Oh, okay. <laughs> She left already. She come. She must have seen me and just scared her to death. I know. Okay, I I'm don't know. A bunch of people. <laughs> you know what, Sally? He was hoping that um something else was gonna happen. The cherry uh, biscuits were gonna. Yeah. <laughs> Bread pudding went up by two percent. I carry. Two percent. Two percent. You poor thing, you. The four hour tour. <laughs> Dono says hi, Tom. Hi. How you doing, Dono? I'm liking your channel, Dono. I hope you got it. You put more stuff out. We keep losing people. They come and they go. And they go and they come. Yeah. Nobody likes you anymore, Tom. <laughs> well, that's just fine. There's a bunch of people. Hi, Olivia. <laughs> Eight, three, and one. He said, did you go to work today? Yes, he did. How'd you enjoy your birthday? I worked on my birthday. How was your dinner, though? Oh, that was awesome. I told everybody what I had, and they said, boy, you're really spoiled. You know that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. He is spoiled. All right, we'll give it a couple more minutes. Everybody make sure you hit the like button. Smash that like button. <laughs> give a slap happy. <laughs> <laughs> Good men do deserve to be spoiled. You are right, Sally. You are 100% right. I've spoiled my men even when they didn't deserve it, but this one actually deserves it. See, I, I can have an official beer. Like. <sighs> I, 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 um, he does sometimes. Tom doesn't really spoil me. He just um, lets me be me, which is... Spoiling it. It's a good thing. He lets me be me and um he accepts me for who I am and he supports me in anything I choose to do. So I would think that that's the most important. Hi Nessa. Oh thank you, Olivia. You guys won't see Olivia because she can't comment, but she's texting me. <laughs> My birthday is November seventh. This year, I'm going to be 57. 57? I know, you right? You're getting to be an old girl, aren't you? Excuse you? I'm only 65. Well, I'm only 56. <laughs> Rob the cradle. All right, so for those of you that um, know yesterday was Tom's birthday, hi, Terry. Oh, Tom, you forgot your bib. I did. Here, go get it. Oh, well, I'm going to get up again. I'm kidding. Don't. Don't. Happy birthday. Oh, you got me a new one. Hi, awesome. Celtic Kiss. We'll put it on. City Girl Homestead. Goodbye, Tom. 
Oh, Jack is on there. He said you need your bib. Oh. Thank you, Olivia. All right, Jack. <laughs> I'll talk to you later, mister. <laughs> you want me to tie you? I can tie me up. Oh, she said you need to model again. So after you get on there, it doesn't have one big pocket. It has two. I got two kangaroos now. No, you don't. Yeah, I do look. See, go. Don't one here, a little one over Yep, says city girl, goodbye, Tom. So give him a give him a uh, model. <laughs> Sit out. <laughs> Can I have your glasses for a minute? Yeah, because they're filthy. Oh my god. I know they are. Alright, so I can tell. what won out today was bread pudding. Only by 2%. 2%! <laughs> he was hoping for the cherry thing. <laughs> I might like the bread pudding. Who knows? He might. Alright, now you might be able to see. He is too funny. Holy smokes, I can see you. <laughs> Alright, so... Up the lights. I know, right? So the first thing you're going to do, Tom, is take this butter... Take a tablespoon of butter and make it go all the way inside your pan there. You can use this. This is going to be a longer one today because it takes 45 minutes to cook. 45 minutes? Yeah, people have to actually put up with you that long. Oh, boy. Let yeah. me just show you how to do that. Yeah, I do what like this. I like that. No, no, no. Here. You want to press hard when you do that? And just get it on there real thick, see? It takes a woman's touch. Uh, it would take a man's touch, too, but you don't want to know how to do it. <laughs> I don't want to get my hands greasy, that's why. I didn't get my hands greasy, either. You did a really nice job there, dear. <laughs> Well, it used to be when we first started baking, when we were girls, we had to do that in flour on every cake or anything. All right, so now you're going to take your bread and fit it in that pan. That's a lot of bread for that pan. Well, you're going to stuff it way down in there. We're going to feed the squirrel with the rest of it? Yes, the squirrel get whatever we don't use. Okay. We are using an Italian loaf or whatever those are called. <laughs> See, Jack, you get to meet your crowd now. You can just pour it. <laughs> it takes 45 minutes to cook, remember? You need more than that. You're going to fill it all the way up. All the way at the top? Yep. Bread pudding. Dono's happy about that. How about that? That better? You need more than that. More than that? Yep. That squirrel didn't get very unhappy. <laughs> no, one piece at a time. <laughs> huh? Sally said you're going to do it one piece at a time. See, because it's going to get pushed down. Put a little bit more there. No, don't you dare do that. <laughs> she said one piece you can a pull time. a couple out at a time. Yeah. Okay. The rest is for the squirrel. The rest is for the squirrel. He'll All right. Him. So put that off to the side for a minute. Funny, but so pathetic. He, he does look so pathetic. All right, so he you're gonna do <laughs> four beaten eggs. I'm still not forgiving him for chewing on my squash plants. Hi, Deborah. I'm glad you're here finally. That's great. Four beaten eggs. Oh, when it has crispy. Keep it right there so people can see what you're doing. Yes, Tom, we get it. Lord. Now you're going to do... There, I beat him. <laughs> you guys, I don't even know. Three quarters of a cup of sugar. <coughs> we lost a couple people. They don't like you anymore. Just dump the whole thing in there. Lord. 
Now two cups of milk. You look like you're a scientist hard at work. <laughs> <laughs> I think he does like to get to me too, Vanessa. What's that? She says you purposely try to drive me crazy. <laughs> that is not true. <laughs> they are biased. It is not true, NASA. Oh, you tell her what Jack, Jack did to Mark? Well, he coffee. already called him. Oh, did he? <laughs> <laughs> I should have opened this beforehand, huh? Yeah. Hi, Jamie. How are you? All right, so you're going to use a teaspoon? A vanilla. That wasn't a teaspoon. It was a teaspoon, Tom. I gotta mix it. No, not yet. I wanna mix it. <sighs> You're gonna do something else before you do that, even. Oh, I wanna mix it first. Nope. You gotta no. do something to the bread first. And well, a I teaspoon. Do the bread. I will tell you in a minute. Alright, so now he's gonna mix all that stuff up, but first he's gotta do this. Grab your bread again. I forgot all about this. Oh, I gotta put the butter on it. Yes, but bring that over here so you don't pour it in on my stove. Oh, you're afraid I'm gonna dump it someplace it shouldn't Make be? Make sure you try to cover every bit of it with two tablespoons of butter. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. All righty then. What is bread pudding? You driving me crazy. That's, you were doing the Jeopardy song. I know. What is bread pudding? So now you're going to mix it all up. Now I get to mix it. Yes. Oh, look at that. Jack said you missed some, Tom. Miss missed some what? The butter. I did not. <laughs> He's... We should do this sometime with Jack and just let him, um... Then I can bully him. Yeah, we should do a Tom and Jack hour. Like a Tom and Jerry? Like oh a Tom God. and Jack? Could you guys imagine? <laughs> Are you actually mixing, or...? I'm trying to, yeah. Oh, Lord. It's getting better. Are you only grabbing from the top? No, I'm grabbing from the bottom. You'd want to do that, Jack? Okay, I'll remember it. Oh, I almost That would be a moment. riot. See, people might want to see you and Jack together. See, I'm making too much of a mess. Here, let me see it. Because you're going too slow. You're afraid to make a mess and get dirty like Jack is. I worked eight hours today. I'm I don't tired. care. You're mixing up eggs and milk. Oh, it's hard on my arm. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> You're doing such a wonderful job there. This is supposed to be you cooking. They see me cook all week. Well, take over. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, look how quick I did that. <laughs> amazing, huh? It is amazing. Now you're going to make sure you cover all of it. Oh, well, I'm going to have to stand up and do that. Well, you do what you got to do, honey. I'll do me. Are you ready? Oh, hi, Ruth. How are you? Are you ready? Yes. It's got to cover over the whole thing, even on the corners, honey. Because any bread that you don't cover, it's going to be hard as a rock. So make sure you get these corner ones. Over here, too. Uh-oh, Tom didn't cover it all. Uh, I did so. No, you didn't. So, what you can do now, Tom, is get your hands dirty and push it down. <laughs> they can't see your face, so. It's a good thing. What do you say when someone envies pudding? I didn't see the answer. He's jelly? <laughs> no, we've never made bread pudding at all, ever. This is a first. I've never even tasted bread pudding. Look at that, Tom. Squish it in there, baby. Ugh. 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 Go. Okay, Tom. Okay, Tom. 
How do you like the sound effects? Yeah. We don't. I mean, no, you don't. <laughs> Here. Get wipe my hand up. Why now? don't you go wash your hands on? Oh, thank you. We have a kitchen sink. I don't. I like the bathroom. Now we're gonna put it in the oven for forty-five minutes. Look at that. I helped him out. So what's been happening with you guys all this week? 45 minutes, that's 7 o'clock. Dun, dun, dun. Ah. Bored. You guys have no idea how difficult it is to live with him. <laughs> Thank you, Jamie. <laughs> I need a glass of water. My 94 year flows. Aw, that's so nice. I feel like a talk, talk, talk show host. <laughs> Here's Tommy! Well, bring that Here's Tommy! You don't like me call Tommy. I don't. Here's Tommy! He some seeds in. Oh, and your grandson's red. That's awesome. Do what? We got to see our grandson swim twice this week. And my son picked him up to I take him home Thursday. Tonight. And he... He did not want to go home with his dad. He wanted to come home with us. <laughs> I'm glad that's fixed, Vanessa. And what was my grandson's doing? Oh, Emerson was getting a diaper change. Oh. Before he got home. <laughs> And did AJ say, Grandpa, Grandpa? Yeah. And the table was Is talking. it going okay, Terry? Everybody continued prayers for Terry's daughter, please. I bet you she is, too. <laughs> she's still having problems? Yeah, but she's detoxing. Mm. It's a hard road. Yes, it is. Very, very hard road. I watched a special on that today, too, and it was very heartbreaking. They have this new thing out called zombie something or whatever. I'm not sure what that is. And Sally, how's your situation? Is everything okay? I won't say what everything is, but... Oh, good. I am so glad, Terry. You know, we have such a great community, you guys. Everybody thinks about each other and looks out for each other. And that's important. You know, in this big old world, sometimes we just don't have that anymore. You know, everybody worries about themselves. It's all about me. Oh, good, Sally. I am so glad. I didn't tell anybody what it was, so. Can, can I remind you of that movie, What About Bob? I don't remember it. Bill Murray. And Richard Dreyfus. Richard Dreyfus was the doctor, and Bill Murray was the patient. It was called "What About Bob?" because Bob always interrupted anything that Richard Dreyfus did that would drive him absolutely nuts. He said he wanted. Hi, to Becca. I would really like to see a Tom and Jack episode. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes we fight like dogs and cats. <laughs> oh, that's Tom and Jerry. Yeah. Tom and, and Jack actually get along very, very well. Did you show them what Jack got you for your birthday? I got a nummy. Well, you suck. Go over there. Over in the back. Where I usually put my wallet. Okay, go get it. It would be a fun episode. Yeah. And I'm just sitting in the, in the living room and watch it on the computer. <laughs> I wouldn't assist them at all. <laughs> now that would be funny. This is what Jack got for Tom. Got me a lion wallet. He got him a lion's wallet. I wouldn't be lying. <laughs> Why would I need a... Hi, Destiny. Why would I need a webcam, Vanessa? A red pan. I just watch it on the internet. Anybody knows Dirt Road Destiny has a um a channel. Make sure you go visit 
Check out my ducks over there. I don't know. You mean for dessert or for food, <laughs> Terry? <laughs> you put that in there and you didn't dump it? No, I didn't. I would have dumped it. <laughs> he does suck sometimes. <laughs> oh, thank you, Ruth. We should throw more cinnamon on. I can tell you that tomorrow, um, we I had gotten five requests. And between here and on my Facebook, I've gotten five requests. Well, six today since Tom requested tuna fish casserole. So all my requests will be fulfilled next and my week. request went first because it's all about Ooh, me. pork steaks. That sounds yummy. That will be next week, too. Just a hint. Oh, thank you, Carrie. She gave me a tip. Awesome. Oh, thank you. You're my second ever. That is so amazing. I want to cry. I'll give you a tip, too. Here. No. Tip. I don't trust your tip. tip. You're old. I want to tip you. <laughs> Here, I'll tip myself. There you go. That works. <laughs> yeah, I tipped you. The tomorrow will be a meatless Monday. And it looks like it's really good. That would be great, Sally. I'd like that. Oh, look, it says keep it up. And I'm gonna put cheeseburger wraps. I did that once, and they're so good. Vanessa posted a recipe, and if she don't hurry up and cook it, I'm gonna be doing it. <laughs> I must be allergic to you. My nose is itching again. Allergic to me? Yeah. Could be my shirt. <laughs> Could. Be. Me. Yeah. What is a pescatarian? Race of the sisters. Yes. <laughs> <Are> you, <Lord? laughs> you heard that, Nessa. <laughs> Only seafood? You know what? I would be good with that, Carrie. I love seafood. <laughs> My wallet couldn't afford it, but I love seafood. Crab legs, shrimp. Swordfish. Squid. Don't know, are you in an area where you can um get all that stuff really cheap? Terry, thank you. Oh, look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys are amazing. He tipped you again? Somebody else. Terry did it. Aww. Oh, okay. <laughs> you guys are making me teary eyed. <laughs> you guys are amazing, honestly. Well, hi, Cooking with Bobby Joe. Cooking with Bobby Joe. My favorite brand of butter is the one with the. They um, it's got a deer on it. <laughs> We're having bread pudding. What is the name of that? We look up in the thing. I, I haven't been able to afford the name brand. Bowls I can. Hi, Becca. It's the one over there with the deer on it. Yeah, what is the name of it? Challenge butter. Challenge butter. It's salted too. I can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> Do you know I but used to oh we grew up on margarine. And I dated a guy named Mike, and he's like, How can you eat that stuff? And so I kind of looked up online what it does, and oh gosh, you guys. I haven't ate margarine since. My mine is too. Oh, it's an elk. <laughs> All right, Destiny. <laughs> what? It's not a deer. It's an elk. Yeah, margarine is gross. I just will not. It's like all plastic. 
Like, it really kills me when we had to do that one recipe and we use those cheese slices. Because <sighs> you know that's all plastic, too. Yeah. So. But all Brienne still does, yeah. I think my kids do, too. Um, do you guys like the voting thing that I make three different choices and you guys pick a choice? Make sure you guys hit that like button. For some reason, YouTube has been screwing with me. Like, I was getting 100 people a week, and I now I got 85 like in the last uh, 28 days. Yes? Good. <sighs> I was doing the like button. A little over nine bucks? Really? Wow. What's over nine bucks? She got some, um, that's kind I used to eat, by the way. Um, country crack over nine bucks. Ooh. <laughs> Me too, Sally. <laughs> she goes, she usually votes even though she usually wants them all. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I was looking online tonight, and I don't know if you guys have ever had it, but my grandma used to make something. And actually, one of the girls at work, she has suggested it to Tom too, because she's like, I love bread pudding. And, um, but I seen it popped up today and it was rice pudding. <sighs> my mom hated it, but she'd make it for me and my dad. But my grandma made the best rice pudding ever. I bet you did, Terry. You know what? There's been some things. I'm going to tell you right now. I've went into the grocery store. I don't go very much, but I've went into the grocery store and I pick it up and I see how much it is. And I'm like, there's no way on this green earth I'm going to pay that. I just, you know, and that's why I've been trying to get more into doing my spices and all that good stuff. Because some of that is just so ridiculous. It's crazy. Well, it's like that gas cap I bought that one time. Or, you know, gas cap. John Deere gas cap. $65 for a little round cap. <sighs> Did you see what I'm voting on for AJ? Or bidding on? Uh-uh. I have my customer. It's a little, little, little dusty online, and I buy cars and stuff because AJ loves cars and trucks and all that good stuff, and he loves tractors. And um, I know right now it's twenty nine. I'm bidding on a John Deere um, snow globe. <laughs> oh, you showed that one, Robert, didn't you? Courtney. Courtney. Tapioca pudding is really good too. Not grapes and it was seven bucks. I know they're like three ninety nine a pound. You know grapes, three ninety nine a pound. I will eat fresh cherries for that cost. I don't no, no, no. Tom loves grapes, but Chris don't like grapes at that price. Tom don't like grapes at that price. <laughs> Tom don't like grapes at that price either. Nope. I don't. Bi banana pudding is good, Ness. I'm thinking about doing, I got these little tiny glass bowls are about this big around and about this deep. And I'm thinking about sending little different things for Tom to work every day so that he has something healthier. So we'll see what I come up with with that. We're trying to get a little bit healthier. That, um... <laughs> That peanut butter pie didn't help, did it? <laughs> no. I felt like I got going to a diabetic coma today. You know what is my ultimate, ultimate favorite pudding? Is butterscotch. I love butterscotch. I love butterscotch. I love lemon. Um, matter of fact, that's the one reason I like to go to my sister's um, Chinese restaurant over there in Portland. Because they have butterscotch pudding. Yes, they do. They're the only ones that do that. I know. I don't see anybody else have butterscotch pudding. But that one over there in Portland does. Ho, ho, ho. Must be one of their specialties. I know. I love it. It just... I love it. Yes, they do, Nessa. Oh, is it Sally? Yeah, I love it. Wasn't that your mom's favorite, too? Yeah, except for she was allergic to it. Oh, she was allergic to it, but it was her favorite. She gets the hiccups. Yeah, Becca, that's... You know what? We actually buy a lot of um, pudding because with Missy, 
it's hard for her to take her medicine. So if, if Jack puts it in the um, pudding, it's easier for her to swallow. Well, you're missing out, Ness. <laughs> she said she don't eat there. That's what we should do some Sunday. Go over there and... Oh, yeah. Just I out. like her, her Chinese buffet over there. Just, just pig out on uh, butterscotch pudding, huh? No. No, I gotta do more than that. I have been really hungry to go to the Chinese place, but... So expensive. Are you gonna eat there if I come, Nessa? <laughs> I don't know, Jack, are you still on there? I will talk to Jack, and if he says he'll do it, would you do an um, episode with Jack? You guys make something? Yeah, we'll do something. I can deal with him for a while, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Tom and Jack. Oh, you will, Jack? Okay. Would you be willing to do an episode with Tom? I love tapioca. Hi, Victoria. You know what, girl? We just put it in the oven so you haven't missed the taste test yet. So we're making bread pudding. Yeah, I can poke him in the belly and go, ooh. <laughs> <does. I> <laughs> <laughs> yes, it would have to be simple, Vanessa. You'd have to think a lot about it. You had condensed milk pudding? No. Oh, I love lemon meringue. Oh, oh yeah. Now you're talking. You know, one of my there. favorite pies is, and Tom doesn't like it. Coconut cream. What? Coconut cream. Ew. He hates coconut. <laughs> yeah. 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 I love lemon meringue. I do, too. <clears throat> Me neither, don't I? I've never heard of that. The lemon is better. But you know what? My dad, and I haven't done it since... My dad taught me how to make meringue, but that was like a thousand years ago. Not a thousand years ago. Well, it was a long time ago. It felt ago. like a very long time ago. No. I was on my own. You hate coconut too? On my own. Do, 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 I do too. I love anything lemon. You'll have to send me the recipe, Dono. The only thing I don't like that's lemon is um, actual lemons and bite into it. Me and Vanessa used to do that to all of our kids. And they liked it, though. That's what's funny. <laughs> but I like lemonade. It gives me heartburn, but I love it. That strawberry lemonade. Hi, Emily. That strawberry lemonade at uh, Red Robin is awesome. Oh, yeah. You and Vanessa get that all the time. The strawberry lemonade. Yeah, I'm sorry, Nessa. It might take a while for that stuff. Like I say, I couldn't drink, after COVID, I could not drink Orange Crush, and I could not stomach um, ramen noodle. Ugh. But she loved ramen noodles. I loved ramen, and I just couldn't, ugh. Tasted like paste. How do you know what it tasted like? Hi, Karen. How are you? I used to eat paste. I can if you guys see in the kitchen with Karen, she has her own channel, and she's got some pretty cool quick videos, so you might want to give her a check out, too. If you guys have a, um, I'm not sure how you share your link, but if you guys have channels of your own, you know, list it down in there so that people can check it out. I don't have any problem at all with um, promoting other people's channels. I know some people do, and they're like, oh, it's competition, can't do that. But I don't do that. So put your name out there if you got, got a channel, channel of too. your own. You do. Yeah, bye, Tom. Bye, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> Karen is awesome. I like her channel, yeah. Destiny knows I like to watch her because she has Scout, and she has Brownie, and I love them. Because they're duckies. They're duckies. She likes And them. for some reason, when I watch Destiny's channel, I just like, and I'm not even a bird person. I'm thinking about it, Becca. Um, I see the ducks out there. Those ducks always calm me down. And, but the chickens, and they're so fancy free and whatever, and she like babies them. It just makes me want to, like, relax. 
Fifty babies or turkey too. You know, I do have a customer that does. I don't know if he does screen printing or if it only does the, you know, like that kind. But I could see. Oh, is it? Oh, so don't promote your channel. How about you just put on there? I have a channel. How's that? Would that work? I don't have a moderator. I should get Manasa. Bye, Tom is a catchphrase. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you're going to be a moderator next time, Nasa. <laughs> That'd be cute, Jessica. Oh, Jamie, you do too? That's great. I love you too, Destiny. Yes, you can promote my channel all day long. <laughs> I would love to see 2,000. I see all these people that started after me and they're like, poof, poof. and I'm like, well, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> that would be great, Jamie. Maybe I'll have you do that. Oh, really? Just... <laughs> She said I should do bandanas for dogs that say bye, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> I got that one off of Amazon. But I do have one customer. I used to have two. Um, but he usually does the embroidered. I'd have to see if he does any of the um, just iron-on. And see if I could do some t-shirts or something. Look how big that one would win. <laughs> <laughs> Let's look at this. See what it looks like. Ooh. Looks like bread <laughs> in a bowl. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Some of the best are smaller ones. You know what, Becca? Um, you are so right. Tom, she wants to know what you do for a living. Not the long, drawn-out thing, either. The long, drawn-out thing. <laughs> I fabricate plastic. Basically. Fabricate plastic. Fabricate plastic. Yes. Molded plastic. I make Ford emblems. I could do high for the holidays, yeah. Um, He retired, actually, from Local 7. Yeah. He was in sheet metal for 35 years. They left him without insurance, so then he had to go back to work full-time. So, um, I do credit card processing, and so when you say look, shop local... That is something I cannot stress enough. Um, I know it's important to buy from, you know, Amazon and Walmart and Target and all that stuff. Yeah, you'll grow too, Jamie. Um, but your local people, even if they charge us a little bit more, those people are literally supporting their families and their communities. And it is very, very important. And especially after COVID, I had a lot of customers that had to close their doors. I had a few of them that died, so it really affected my income, too. But shop local anytime you can. That's nice, Terry. So you're going to get a few more, too. Do I have any Valentine's Day plans? I'm not going to kill the husband. <laughs> no. <laughs> a theme show, we might be able to do something like that. I'm just going to lick my way. No, you're not. <laughs> oh, my God. I'd have to think of something themed. I'm going to be like a little puppy. <laughs> I have a spatula that I could hurt you with. That's okay. Hi, Mama B. I'll survive the spatula. Make sure you guys hit that like button. I can't believe it. You know, I keep looking up there and I see the tips. That is so amazing. Hi, JD. Say hi to JD. Barbie Wave. It's a guy, I think. I don't think you want to do Barbie Wave. Barbie Wave. <laughs> I think so, too. I love collaborations. I think they're fun. You know what this is? What? It's a real wave. <laughs> it's a what? A real wave. <sighs> Do you, who feels sorry for me that I have to be married to Tom? 
Actually, we joke around a lot, and you know what? It makes um. <laughs> Will you stop poking at me? I'm pushing my like button. A favorite kitchen product review. Huh. My favorite kitchen product's me. But anyway. No. <laughs> I do have a couple things I like. Kitchen products. Whatever, Nas. Comment. It was really, really good. Really, really good. I like the comment. That's my kitchen product. <sighs> That's not what they're it talking about. It smelled like wheat. Mm, I like the smell of wheat. You know, twice this week, actually, we fed my youngest son. We fed him that um, sheet pan tacos and then that um, chicken and stuff. Yeah. Chicken Thank you, Destiny. Thank you, Jamie. That chicken um, noodle soup, you guys, I am not a soup person. Yes, I did. I um, taught my boys, they're older, they're 28 and 31, but I taught them, yes, to cook. And when my grandson was here for a week, if you go back into my videos, you'll see things I did with my little grandson. He was three at the time. and I can cook. I think you lie. <laughs> Even my mom thought I could cook. Yeah, right. Um, I think it's very important, whether it's a boy or a girl, I think they should know how to cook. And actually, my boys are pretty darn good cooks, aren't they? Mm. So, Tom's son, Nate cooks. Yeah, he can cook. He cooks, yep. He has to, you know. Yeah, he broke up with his girlfriend, so he kind of has to if he wants to eat. So. He there to go out all the time. Yeah. I don't think he'll do that. He eats a lot of salad, and so. Yeah, do you have a channel, Terry? I don't know if you, if I ever asked you that. <laughs> oh, he's 4'2", Victoria. How sweet. Yeah, AJ just turned That's four. That's when become aliens. It is important, Mama B. It is. We will be having a garden again this year, yes. Did, did I tell you about that? What? Miranda's kid just turned 14 not too long ago, and he's like an alien. She says he just goes. To I school. told you. I says, yep, yeah, that's what happens. I says, they come on up, and they come back. You don't know shit. They hey, hey, watch your mouth. You, you don't know anything, and they're, you're dumb, and they know everything. She I says, told you that. Yep. She said that's basically what he is. I says... We are talking about kids turning 14 and how they turn into aliens. I told Tom that. I said, you know, there are all these lovey-dovey kids, and then when they turn 14, boom! <laughs> aliens. Somebody like sucked an your kid up and sucked them up and left somebody else. Mine. So what kind of... um? Thank you, Terry. My favorite vegetable to grow. Even though they bother my belly right now, I love tomatoes. <laughs> they just don't like me. But I love tomatoes. I love tomatoes too. I do. When yeah, I was a I kid, and we lived on a farm. Oh, that's nice. Um, My kids... Yeah, actually, they were good. They were. I, um, you know, they fought amongst each other. <laughs> they don't talk to each other now at all, but, yeah, my kids didn't get in any trouble, really, you know? Yeah, yours too. They, um, they mouth back once in a while and all that good stuff, you know, once in a while they get too loud, but, um, even my youngest, his friends were cool to hang out with, and, yeah, they were pretty good kids, actually. They got mouthy, but other than that, didn't. They were slobs and mouthy, but that's it. My favorite tomatoes are big boy and big girl. I love them. I like the cherry tomatoes. Oh, yeah. Well, that's 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 rough. But, but we won't get the grape tomatoes again. Yeah, we're not doing grape tomatoes this year. And Tom, if he ever gets time, he's going to build us a thing that goes up in the air and then it'll have lines coming down so we can try to 
grow our tomatoes and our beans and stuff upwards. Absolutely. <clears throat> Every kid's got to live and learn, you know. I told my kids, you know, if you go out and do stupid stuff, you make sure, like, if you've been out drinking or whatever, which I never had to worry about that, but, you know, you don't ever get in a car. And actually, our my oldest son was, um, he went over to his cousin's house, and he called me up, didn't he? It's not too far from here, and he was plenty and eight old enough to be drinking and stuff, and he's like, Mom, I'm over at Jeff's, and I've had too much. Can you come get me? And I'm like, you wait right there. He called me three weeks ago, mm -hmm. and he, he's been going through some stuff with his divorce, and I said, don't get in the car. I'll be right there to get you. So I drove 45 minutes out there. <laughs> mm -hmm. We do have a great community here. That's something that, you know, um, I know we're going to try again. Um, ouch, it's got cramp in my leg. But <laughs> um, I think that even though I'm not that big, I think we've got a lot of really, really good people. And that, you know, um, it's like everybody's looking out for each other. And... I'm that type of person, like, I'm not super liberal or anything like that, but I do believe that people, people should come above government. You know what I mean? Like, we need to think about each other instead of, I don't know how to explain it, but yeah. <laughs> too many people anymore, they don't. She said, Tom, help me with that cramp. <laughs> I'm the what? Help her with the cramp. We're both kind of lame today, and yesterday too. But I really think that um, if more people looked at, after each other, um, the world would be a lot better place. I do. I think it'd be a lot better place. So many people are me, 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 and they could give two craps about other people. And I've noticed a lot in our younger generation, our kids. I mean, they're good kids, but you know, they just don't have, um, no, they don't, Jamie. <coughs> Anybody that thinks the government cares about you, yeah. yeah. Government don't care about nobody. Thank you, Destiny. You already started plants outside, Victoria. Where do you live? We have snow on the ground right now. You know what, Terry, you're right. We're up to 31. Woo, 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 woo. That's the big number right there. <laughs> you had that one out. You know what? I just always say like this, you know, even when people are, we're a statistic, you're right. Um, even if somebody's nasty to you, you know what? I'm not trying to quote the Bible, but it says how to, you know, turn the other cheek. I mean, there's only so many other times you can turn the cheek, but so many people get uh, so offended over nothing. <laughs> and it just really throws them, you know. My sons, only one of them, well, two of them are still married. The one will be divorced in April. They were here today kind of hammering things out. And I told her she can call me anytime. I have known her for, I want to get teary. <laughs> I've known her for 13 years and she was my first daughter. And I, I still love her no matter what. And it's going to be hard to be without her. And uh, the one that his son broke up with... <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. She love and my other, my son that, um, 34? That's a goal. We've done it bigger. Um, ding, 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 ding. She's, she's an amazing mom. She's a good wife. And I will tell you about my daughter-in-laws, even the ex-girlfriend of his. Those girls are some hardworking girls. And, I mean, those girls were hardworking. They'll work round the clock if they have to. 35! <laughs> yeah, they, they're hard workers, and so I liked them all. His son's girlfriend. <sighs> New Mexico, 76. Oh. She's a hard worker, though. She's a hard worker, but... Yeah. She told me a fib. I don't like liars. Because then you got to keep lying. And Jesus does love you, whoever just said that. 
<clears throat> We're 35. Oh, 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 oh. We should do the bump. My my back hurts too much for the bump, but we can do this. Ready, guys? 35. 35. Ooh, 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 ooh. Isn't that exciting? Look at that. 35. <laughs> That's right. There's so many it is. I don't even have enough room on the screen. We'll do the wave or the shuffle, whatever it happens to be. <laughs> She's on the victory dance. That is seriously the, oh we're down to thirty three. <sighs> you ever seen a Polish disco? Um, what was the fib? She had her son lie to us. Said she had the flu. Did not, because her and I have different um, opinions on uh, certain things. So what was worse is she actually had my son lie to us. And I caught her in several of them, didn't we? Mm -hmm. I can't trust liars. That's something I always brought my kids up. I don't care what you do. If you tell me the truth, I'm down to 31. I bet, Jessica. <laughs> I bite my tongue till it bleeds. You ever seen the Polish disco? No. You want to see the Polish disco? What? You ready? It's oh, awful gosh. difficult. It's awful difficult. You ready? Here it is. This goes here, this goes there. No more of those jokes then. <laughs> I know, we're down to 30. What happened? I celebrated too Didn't hard. Didn't like my joke. But anyway, I brought my sons up that as long as they told me the truth, I don't care what they did, they wouldn't get in trouble. But I told them if I catch you in a lie, Be crucify your, your butt is mine. <laughs> crucify them. So my kids, they're pretty, they're pretty honest and they tell me stuff I don't even want to know. He is, and he knows that now, too. Doesn't he know Nate's so much better off without her? Oh, for sure. He is so much more like our son again. Like, he's come over, he's kicked back on the couch, and, you know, watch TV with us, and just, yeah, he's come over and had dinner. We're down to 29. I celebrated too quickly. Yeah, the other one, maybe he'll break up with the other thing. I have one amazing grand, great er, daughter-in-law. Yeah. I didn't make them. We didn't know for three months that they had broke up. And he finally told us. Actually, we bumped into her at the fire station. Hi, Odette! You made it! I think she thought at the fire station I was going to say something to her, but um, hello, AJ was with me, and she was around her workers. And um, so she gave me a look like, oh, my God, what is she going to say? You're going to kill me. That's not on video. <laughs> she came in, and she looked at me like. We started at 6. <coughs> at 6.53. Yes. Oh, Dad is here today. That's awesome. Why okay. did he do what? I'm going to sneak a peek at our bread pudding. Okay, you sneak a peek. Oh, my God. We're going to stop. I don't want to screw it. <laughs> He's taking a peek, peek at it because he doesn't want to scare it. Boo! Ah! <laughs> it scared me. <laughs> <laughs> Tom is really good for a laugh. I think we should throw some oregano on top of that. Oh. Hey. What? I think we should put some oregano on that. We're not putting oregano on that. Why not? No, I wouldn't have. No, I wouldn't have said anything to her. How about garlic? I was just grateful she was out of her lice. How about garlic? No. You can put garlic? Make it like See, I'm not like that. I don't I don't believe in disrespecting anybody in public. Like if Tom makes me angry, I wait till we get home. Then she kicks me in the butt. Oh you thought you were really <laughs> anybody got advice for a child under one? Under one get lots of sleep before they're born. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. 
just you know when you're when you're raising up your kids, stick to what you say. I don't exactly. care if they're and one. Always follow through with the, uh, yes. the punishment. That's if you something don't, you lose the battle. Yep, and I did that myself. I would, you're gonna get it, and then they didn't get it, and they're like, oh. so they just kept doing it because they knew they weren't. Gonna I get will, it. Jessica. I have one son you can pray for to my oldest one, please. Be consistent. That's right, Sally. Pray over your kids. I believe that too. Be there and and teach them to be strong individuals, even when they're little. Like my youngest grandson, he's only seven months old, and he's pulling himself up, and he's crawling all over the place. But teach them to be strong on their own as well. Yes, I am, Becca. Yes, I am. Yes, it's in the oven, Odette. Bread pudding. Yeah. Take another peek. Well, you gotta touch it to see how hard it is. I'll bet it's really hot. <laughs> we'll scooch back a little bit. Ow. Ow. Yes. We'll pray for them too, Victoria. What does it say on here? Does it spring back after lightly touching it with a fork? Hold on. Advice. I didn't get to see that. Yeah, look. I'd give it a couple more minutes. Still a little doughy. Did that still doughy? Hmm? doughy? Doughy? I agree with that. And pick your battles with your kids. Oh, really, Oda? <laughs> well, if you weren't so far away, I'd give you the leftovers. But with your kids, pick your battles. Because there's some things that are just not that important. And then there's things like when I tell my kids to tell the truth and whatever. You need to pick your battles and stick to it. And don't don't sway on that. Like honesty and integrity. Um, respectfulness. Those were very, very important things for me. My and boys will still open. Don't talk back to you. Oh, pfft. they're teenagers. Yeah, you got to do that too. You know what, Odette? That's something I learned from my first marriage. And this goes in marriage. It is, you've got to pick your battles because not everything. He left the socks on the floor is not worth World War Three. <laughs> you know? Him being a jerk and, and, you know, quit his job or do whatever, that's a little different. But, you know, I mean, you got to pick your battles with that. We're down to 35. People didn't like my dancing. You should have told me I looked like an idiot. <laughs> Would you believe me? No. That's why I didn't tell you. That's something that I do with Tom. I know it sounds funny. We've been married 10 years, and, and um, I don't believe in it either. Um, we've been 10, 10 years in April and I ask him all the time, hi Janet, um, you know, is there anything that I could be doing to make you happier, you know, or is, and we need to keep that line of communication. We met online in Craigslist dating site. Somebody asked how we met. Mm. Craigslist. Craigslist. Oh, hi, my happy girl. Steph. Look, I got some good channels coming on here tonight. Woo-hoo! <laughs> All right, I'll dance again. Maybe they'll come back. My dad used to say, Girl, never drive behind yourself. <laughs> never drive behind yourself? Because... <laughs> How about when you was four and you stood out the car seat and said, I'm mad? Well, that was my very first words. It wasn't mama, daddy, nothing. My dad said I stood up in the back of the seat. That's before car seats. And he goes, oh, I'm mad, is what I said. And he goes, you've been mad every since. But no, he goes, never ride behind yourself in the car. And I go, why is that? Because, you know, if bumping music would come on or something with a lot of groove, whatever, I'd be like this and singing and whatever. My dad goes, you look so dumb. <laughs> I go, then don't ride behind me. <laughs> I used to do that to my kids. Like they'd be in the car. <laughs> and I'm not, 
if anybody's slow, please don't take offense to this. But it'd be summertime. We'd pull up at Saginaw and wait. <laughs> the window's down. The window's down because my air conditioner didn't work. And somebody'd be sitting there with their windows down too. And I'd be like, Cush the fuck, where we going? <laughs> he would hide down in the seat. He's like, Mom, stop that. <laughs> Maybe no, don't do that. <laughs> he didn't think it was too bad when I ordered yes. McDonald's and Donald Duck. Me too. I loved you too. Oh, bye, Victoria. Bye, Victoria. Bye, Terry. Now I'm going to see his taste. You we'll have to watch it later so you can see what if we liked it. What's it? Terry and Victoria got to leave and just behind. They got to leave. Oh, my God. You need to get a um hot pad. I don't need a hot pad. Yes. I'm going to grab that pump in my hand. Yeah, here, 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 here. I'm tough. Thank you for all of you. You're still there. Nessa, did you leave me? My own sister. <laughs> Believe it. She wanted to. <laughs> I'm ready. Bye, Here Sally. This is almost done, I promise. My God. We try to keep it within an hour because... Oh, you're here, Nessa? Okay. All right, good, Victoria. Here Thank we you. go. Da, 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 da. The reason that we try to keep it at an hour... Thank you, Terry. Is because I know Sunday nights... To me, that's family night, and, you know, people are getting ready for work and all that good stuff, so. Ready for work? Getting ready for this. He has a website, too, or a channel, Dono Homestead. Oh, look at that. Oh, my. That actually kind of looks good. Smells Should good. we try it? I turned the stove off, so too okay. late to do anything else. Why don't you grab us a plate? A man's job is never done. A man's job is never done. Here, I'm going to get you closer, guys. You ready? Doesn't that look good? Will you get your hand out of the way? It puts a reflection they can't see. We need a spatula. You can close that now. This one? I started working on my son's taxes today and his soon to be ex wife. Oh my. Oh my, Tom. Oh my, Tom. It smells good. It does smell really good. And no, you can't have none, Jack. <laughs> Be still on Jack there, just said, a, I'll be there in I'll a minute. A <laughs> <laughs> See, that was that one. <laughs> now I know why he's watching. He wanted to make sure it was done and over with. So he wants to know when the food, yeah. He's, pr done. he's probably out the door now, so he probably is. Probably knocking on the door right now. He didn't have to cook all this weekend, by the way. So for that lady that thought that I was taking advantage of, they had chicken noodle soup yesterday, and they had tuna fish casserole today. So... Yeah. Take some. Oh, it smells so good. You guys want to smell? Uh. Yes, you can come get, anybody can come get a plate. Eat your food. Mmm. Mmm. Jack is at the door. <laughs> is that guy telling you guys how close he lives? You forgot your chef hat, Jack. <laughs> okay, well, she said I could have none. See? Here, Jack. I have a revolving door. We have a code. <laughs> we have a code. <laughs> There you go, Jack. Let me know <laughs> how they do. Oh, yeah. I think I another bite. We need to get another bite. I don't think so. <laughs> Give him another bite. Okay, here, Jack. I'm being Tom. <laughs> He's being Tom. Here you go. Here. 
Look at Jack's new haircut. Nessa cut it really short. What do you think, you guys? That's awesome. Jeez, Jack, just run over to Chris's house. <laughs> well, you tell me what happened, I'm stuck over here. <laughs> I could hear him coming up the steps, too. I could do. <laughs> and I'm breathed out. Yeah, once you said, I bet he stepped right off the side door. Right here. <laughs> See, now, Jack, when what? you come on over here and cook with me, I'm going to poke yeah. your belly and you go, Whoa! <laughs> You look like a Bill Berry no boy. You need one too. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you some a, a white outfit. She can look like a real Bill Berry no boy. Mmm. <laughs> That's a good idea, Mama B. What's that? Next time, put a caramel sauce over it. Oh, that do sound good. You know what, yeah. you guys? I'm really glad. That you suggested that. It's actually pretty young. Oh, yeah. See, all three of us tonight. We should get Jack a... Bye, Jack. <laughs> 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 we do have some caramel in the refrigerator, you know. Yeah. It's I kind of... You know what? It says bread pudding, but it really is nice and, like, creamy like pudding. Yeah. It's real good. Mmm. And I'll just say this, you did a good job. Thanks, Jack. <laughs> you got crunchy piece. Want the rest, Jack? Oh, sure. I said you don't want it. I didn't say that you want it. <laughs> you got to twist Jack Jack's arm. Can you tell? <laughs> well, you guys, it's 706. I know you guys got kids, grandkids, work, all that good stuff. Thank you for the tips tonight. That is amazing. You guys brought tears to my eyes, didn't they? Yeah. That was Who's just... That? He even put it in the dish. Good thing it was. I'm sorry. I don't talk much. On It's just how I am. I just don't talk much. Okay. If you wait a minute, I'll send you home with some with Missy, okay? All right. That's where <laughs> she gets some. That's where she gets some. Oh, oh, oh. boy. Did you hear what he just said? I'll send some with Missy to, for Missy. He goes, that's if she gets any. Bye, Ruth. Thank you. I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. You got to stick around for this too, Jay. You guys are... Oh, thank you, Jessica. Yes, she eats everything I send to her, Vanessa. Um, You guys are absolutely the best group. So make sure you guys do like, share, subscribe... Hit that notification button. I really would appreciate it. And thanks for the tips. That was awesome. And thanks for being the best community out there. You guys talk to us and, and you pray for other people and you're there for other people. And it's like, honestly, it's like I don't need a moderator because you guys all say hi to each other. And I love it. So from our house to yours, ready, everybody? You got to give kisses too, Jack. We love you guys. You guys have a very, very blessed night. Bye, Tom. Bye, Tom. Bye, Jack. Bye, Jack. Bye, Tom. <laughs> we love you guys. You're the best. Stay Bye. safe. I know. Thank you. All right. We're going to let you go because Tom's now got to take a shower so he can get back up and go to work again in the morning. Poor thing. Love you guys. Many blessings to all of you. Hi, Tom. <laughs> Bye, Tom. <laughs>